I just won $25,000 for potentially finding a biomedical way to predict those at risk for suicide. I'm Natasha Koviwat, and I'm a senior at Jericho High School in Long Island, New York. I'm a 2024 Science Talent Search finalist. So I've always been very interested in neuroscience and mental health and the intersection between the two fields. And how I got started was that I noticed very early on that we weren't making as much progress in regards to diagnostics or interventions in the field of mental health as compared to other infectious diseases. So I did a lot of reading on suicide in particular. And since then, I just started my research. So my research mostly consists of two parts. For the first part of my research, I looked at brain tissue from those who died by suicide and controls and found that there was an increase in this protein biomarker in the brains of suicide victims. For the second part of my research, I looked at genome-wide data of those who died by suicide and in controls to discern genetic risk for future therapeutics to target these genetic vulnerabilities. My research serves as a small puzzle piece that will hopefully advance the way we view diagnostics for suicide in the future. So for instance, many decades down the line, we can expect a patient to get a blood draw and these certain proteins can be detected. And if we see spikes in these protein levels, then we can also compare with the self-report questionnaire scores and also the information that we get from the clinical screening. And we can further supplement potential advice for diagnostics or interventions and other steps going forward to hopefully catalyze suicide prevention. I'm going to be an incoming freshman at Harvard University studying neuroscience and hopefully down the line I can become a pediatrician and I also still want to continue my research and pretty much anything in the neuro field I'm very open to doing so I'm really looking forward to that.